How does the HPV vaccination actually work? It protects women against the infection that triggers off cervical cancer in the same way that all vaccines work to prevent infections by producing neutralising antibody. So is it necessary to get all of the recommended doses of the HPV vaccine? It's highly desirable to get all the doses because that gives us best chance of getting long-term protection. Yeah, so what happens if you only get two of the doses? If you miss a dose, then the vaccine can be given at another time in the future. If yeah, there's no problem with a catch-up, it's just that you won't be fully protected mm -hmm. until you've had all of the doses. So I know we're really lucky to be able to get the vaccines at our school for free, although why is it important for girls in developing countries to get these? Cervical cancer is a disease that happens worldwide and indeed most of the deaths occur in the developing world where there's no screening programs for cervical cancer. Mm -hmm. So it's really important to vaccinate because that's the only way we can control cervical cancer in the developing world. Okay, so in your opinion, what's the biggest barrier to eliminating cervical cancer? Look, the biggest barrier to eliminating cervical cancer is awareness. We need to educate people about what cervical cancer is about and about how we can best prevent it. And perhaps we have to make it clear that it is in fact a very common disease and it's an entirely preventable one. So why is it necessary for, for boys to get the HPV vaccine as well? Look, there are several reasons for that, maybe. One is that boys get cancers caused by these viruses as well. It's not as common as cervical cancer, but it's common enough. The second one is, of course, that by vaccinating the boys, we protect the girls and vice mm -hmm. versa. And the third reason is that, particularly in the developing world, it's really important not to have a program targeted at one sex because people are suspicious of that. Mm -hmm. And therefore, by vaccinating everybody, it's clear that this is something for the benefit of the community and not some threat to one particular group within the community.